Hey guys, welcome to Phone Arena's in-depth video review of the Dell Venue Pro, which is available online through Dell for the no contract price of $449.99 or $99.99 with a contract through T-Mobile. Now this is an 8GB variant that we have, they do offer a 16GB one, a Windows Phone 7 device that sports a portrait style keyboard and it could arguably be the best Windows Phone 7 smartphone to date. Now we gotta admit that the Dell Venue Pro shows off the kind of talent that Dell has when it comes to crafting smartphones. In fact, the Venue Pro is actually one of the better designed handsets of late to be checked out. Its industrial design consists of some hard lines which has, with some angular cutouts on the top and bottom to give it a really distinguishable look from everything else out there. The choice of materials is top notch too. You have the chrome sides which is uh, accented well with the uh, rubberized bottom and top of the handset. While on the back it just simply uses a glossy plastic the copper. It has this unique design to it. Um, it does attract some smudges and fingerprints, but overall we're satisfied with the uh, beautiful looks of the device. It is a little bit larger than most others and you'll definitely notice the weight. And especially when you open it up to reveal its ported keyboard, it just feels really massive. Yet another unique thing about the Dell Venue Pro is its curved glass. Um, as you can tell, as we're, as we're tilting the handset at extreme angles, you'll notice the display kind of distorting. That's just because uh, of the curved glass that it employs. And it is a 4.1 inch display. It's AMOLED technology and has resolution of uh, 480 by 800 WVGA. So even the smallest of text, it's going to be very easy to make out. We didn't have any problems as far as using it. Um, it has a really nice sharpness to it. Great contrast ratio just because of the AMOLED palette utilizes and colors are vibrant, distinguishable and lush. It's very responsive to the touch and we're overall happy with its uh, unique looking display. Beneath the touch screen you simply have the touch sensitive buttons. You have the back, home and search keys. They're spaced enough far away from one another to reduce any accidental presses. On the right side of the phone, you simply have the dedicated shutter key, which is slightly raised from the surface and offers a good distinctive feel. And the volume rocker, even though it's recessed, uh, it does offer a really nice tactile response. On the top, we're just simply greeted to a 3.5mm headset jack in an appropriate position here and dedicated power button. It's circular, it is recessed, and it's very difficult to make out with the finger. Well, on the bottom edge, you'll simply find the speakers and the micro USB port. And finally, in the rear, you're simply going to find the 5 megapixel autofocus camera, the LED flash, and when you remove the back cover, it just gives you access to the battery and the SIM card slot. There's a moderate response when you open and close the handset and you have to give it a really good nudge to get it to open into place. Once you do, you're going to be greeted to its four row QWERTY keyboard. As you can tell, buttons are pretty cramped and small, so people with larger fingers will probably have an issue with it. Even though it might look like it's flush to the surface, they're kind of rounded to, or bubbled towards the middle to give you a slight uh, distinctive feel. The plastic buttons, they're a little bit hard, uh, but when you press down on them, they do offer a decent tactile response and we didn't have too much of a problem using the keyboard. Similar to other Windows Phone 7 devices we checked out, the Dell Venue Pro packs a 1 GHz processor under the hood. So moving about the platform is very swift and responsive and that's the consistent theme that we see between all these devices. Now with the home screen, you have your live tiles here. Some of them are dynamic, most of them are static right now. Um, it does offer some personalization. You can change the color themes. You can even move about the, um, the uh, live tiles to different spots. Aside from that, the experience is pretty, pretty much the same as we see in other devices. Aside from the typical Windows Phone 7 applications such as Bing Maps and even uh, Microsoft Office, you have ones here preloaded on the device such as Family Room, you have even um, this application called Newsroom, which basically displays stuff like the weather, you have some news information and even stocks, similar to other customized or personalized experience software applications that we find on other devices, Page One's personal finance, and you also have T-Mobile TV. Even though you have the option of using the keyboard, the physical one, you do have the on-screen options as well. And just like other Windows Phone 7 devices, it's very responsive and quick. And we didn't have too much issues as far as using it. It does offer predictive text too. When you tilt it to landscape, it's of course going to give you a little bit more room to make it really easy on your fingers to speed type. If you love web browsing, you're going to be happy with the experience on the Dell Venue Pro just because like other Windows Phone 7 devices, it's very responsive to the touch. You can double tap to zoom into a specific area. Thanks to the high resolution, it makes even the smallest of text very easy to read. Multi-touch gesture support is, is enabled, so you do have uh, flexibility of zooming. As you can tell, scrolling is very fluid and smooth, and it loaded up our page fairly quickly too. Since this is a Windows Phone 7 device, uh, you're going to be treated to the full-blown Zune experience, which is one of the better looking music players out there in the market. As far as the audio quality from its speaker, it's very deafening and loud and very sharp to the ear. 
Thanks to its brilliant looking AMOLED display, watch your videos is a joy and easy on the eyes. Colors very deep and saturated. On top of that, uh, it runs at a nice frame rate, no slowdown or lag. The one we have here is encoded in DivX 1280 by 720 resolution, and as you can tell, it's running just fine. Now with the Delvania Pro's 5 megapixel autofocus camera, it does an average job in taking photos outside. Now even though there is a decent amount of detail, we just find ourselves constantly fighting the sensitivity of its exposure, so it tends to make images look kind of dark. Um, indoors though, the LED flash fails to illuminate anything. We're not particularly too fond of the Dell Venue Pro's ability to shoot 720p. First of all, we do have to fight with the constant changes in white balance. It doesn't offer continuous autofocus, so it does look a little bit dull or fuzzy, especially with close-ups. And finally, um, there's a noticeable amount of artifacting, especially in low lighting conditions. Although the earpiece on the Dell Venue Pro is able to emit some really strong tones, there is a little bit of a static noise that can be heard when it's placed on the loudest volume setting. On top of that, voices do sound a little bit on the muffled side. Luckily for our callers, they didn't have any problems. Our voices was pretty clear on their end. When you switch to using the speakerphone, it does provide some ample volumes, but just like the earpiece, it is, voices do sound a little bit muffled. Signal strength appears to be a little bit on the weak side, especially when you grip the handset towards the bottom. You'll notice right now in high coverage areas we have four bars and it drops down to three, or even two right now. So uh, when we take out our hand off it, um, it does appear to go back. But luckily, we didn't have any issues as far as drop calls with it. Battery life seems to be average on this device. On normal usage, we managed to get out roughly 18 hours before it required a charge. So heavy users will constantly want to uh, charge it up. For light users, you'll easily get by a solid day. Despite its mediocre performance in categories such as the battery life, calling quality, and camera capability, the Dell Venue Pro is by far the most beautifully designed Windows Phone 7 device out there in the market. And for $100 for the 8GB version or $150 for, for the 16GB option, it's a great deal when you have features like the 4.1 inch brilliant looking AMOLED display, the curved glass that it offers, and of course the physical keyboard which should be a great thing for any messaging users out there. So if you'd like to learn more about the Dell Venue Pro or for a latest cell phone reviews, news specs, and information, check us out at phonerena.com.